How's Mr. Donny today? Donny is not good today. Donny is not good two out of every three days. Why? What's the problem today? No problem, but I feel sad today. No, you're not good today, but no problem today, but you feel sad today. So why do you feel sad today? Because I don't want to fun. <laughs> don't want to what? I don't want to fun and I will be sad. You don't want to have fun? Yes. You want to be sad? Yes. <laughs> yes, sir. Fix your lights. Fix your lights. You got a big glow on your face. You can't see you very well. Oh, you got the light turned to the camera. Turn it towards your face. The other way. That way. Point the light that way, behind you. Yeah, that way. Now, now we can see you. Now your mom will be happy. <laughs> Press the knee, Huang. So how come you don't want to be happy? Happy's good. No. Uh, I was happy from Monday to Friday. So you miss school. You want to go back to school. You don't like having a day off. Oh. <laughs> um, what's in school? I know. Because uh, uh, today we had uh, someone was S F1 in my class. A new student is F1 in your school this week? Yes. Oh, because there was another F1 last week in one of the schools in Kumfa. Kumfa, yeah? Yes. Ah, so now there's two. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, and I'm so, and two and a half. So that's why you don't want to have fun today. Yes. Because someone else is F1, but you're not F1. You have to have fun. Fun is good. Fun is very uh, good. That is no good. Sad is sad. Sad is sad. <laughs> fun is fun. Sad is sad. That's right. All right, buddy, you got your languages there? You ready to do some reading for me? Yeah. All right. I love it when you guys read to me. It's like you guys are telling me bedtime stories, and then I can just go to sleep. It's awesome. <laughs> How's your mom? Uh, she isn't here. How is she? I didn't say where is she. I said how is she? She fine now. She's fine now, but she wasn't before? No, um, uh, fine, she's good. How's your dad? My dad is good. My dad is good. My dad is good. Everything good. Everything not good. me, except you. You you just want to be sad. Everything is good, but not for me. <laughs> Everything is very good for you. All right, let's have some fun. Let's read about the languages of the world. Tell me all about it. You can start reading when you're ready. Uh, reading. Are you reading now? Yeah. Take your time, right? You want to remember what you're reading. So read to learn. Languages of the world. 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 Languages yeah. of the world. Uh, there are around 7,000 different languages in the world today. Languages are that are similar to eight other are in the in groups or families. Some languages has have a, a lot of speakers and and others have a few. Many the smaller languages has no writing but is but when the last speaker dies, language dies too. Yeah. All right, so each other, similar to each other, not e other, each other. Each other. Yeah, each other, each one. So, Europe. So, and, and yeah, of course, some languages, of course, they don't have any writing. So once they die, they won't, no one will ever know. 
Yeah, well, we'll all die someday, but not today. All right. Let's read about Europe. Tell me about the languages in Europe. Era. Europe. 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 Europe has 2,000. What? What? Different. 2,000? Ah, 200. Uh, 18. For 184, 2084. 284. <laughs> 284. Uh, <laughs> 284. 284. Not 18. 80. 80. Yes. Different. Different languages. One language family here is Roman language, exclude Spain, Portuguese, Italian. Another is saving language such as Russian, Polish, and correct. Oh. English is the third language, language, language in the world with uh, with two hundred three. Uh, 13, 35 million speakers. Um, they belong to Germanic group and basically language from France and Spain is very unusual. It doesn't belong to any language family. Asia. Asia oh, has... Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go back to Europe here. Got to work on that pronunciation, right? Family, uh, family here is Romance language, which includes Spanish. Portuguese and Italian. Another language family, a group of languages, like their origins, where they come from, is Slavic. Right? These languages, such as Russian, Polish, Czech, um, these come from the same origins, the same history, same ancestry. Right? English is the third largest spoken language in the world about 335 million speakers. It belongs to the Germanic, not Germanic, Germanic. Germanic. Yeah, so some languages belong to that group where it started. The Basque, or Basque, I'm not sure how you pronounce that, language from France and Spain is very unusual. It doesn't belong to any language family all right so basque is an actual language it's not a family language so i got that wrong earlier i remember hearing or reading about basque i think it goes all the way back to the roman times i have to do some research on that so i can explain this in the next class um okay so there we go it talks about the different families of languages in asia europe let's go to asia 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 has two thousand Three hundred and three languages. Three languages. Chinese has a uh, billion speakers. Billion. Like billion. Billion speakers. More than any other language in the world. Hindi is the worst for languages. Language. Ah, Hindi is the worst for languages. Ah, languages. Language. language in the language and Arabic become fit is some part of Asia have a very large number of languages. Okay, yeah. So some part of it um, have a very large number of, of languages. Yeah, a lot of languages in Asia, that's for sure. All right, let's read about the Americas. Now remember, when we say the Americas, we're not talking about the USA. Okay. Okay, the Americas is all the countries in North America and South America, right? Americas, plural. It's Canada, USA. USA, Mexico, Guatemala, uh, you know, Costa Rica, Panama, El Salvador. Obama. Uh, yeah. <laughs> What's the equator there? Ecuador, Venezuela. Brazil, Argentina, Chile, Peru, all of those countries over there, those are all the Americas. That's why they call it the United States. It's the United States of 
part of America. Yeah. yeah. All right. So let's talk about all those countries now. All right. Um, Americas. Americas. This area has 1,060 languages. English and Spanish are the largest. Spain with 406 million speakers. Spanish. Just like fish. Spanish. Spanish. Yeah. With uh, 406 million speakers. The second largest language of Portuguese. Portuguese. Portugal. Ronaldo. Portugal. Portuguese. Portugal. Portugal. Portuguese. Portuguese is spoken in Brazil and many English French in Canada. There are so other native languages. For example, uh, for example, ma example. example. Example, ma. Uh, M. Ma, ma, um, ma, 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 those pyramids and temples in Mexico and down southern Mexico, Central America, Guatemala, where they're like thousands of years old. It was a very big empire until the Spanish uh, invaded and colonized Central America. Um, oh, ma'am, or ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Ma'am. Mayan language. A Mayan, Mayan language. language. Good people speak in past. Of Mexico and Guta Morena. <laughs> I knew you never heard that. No. <laughs> What's that work? That's a country, right? South, southeast corner of Mexico. All right. So look at the letters. Gua. Gua. Guna. Mala. Guatemala. Guatemala. Guatemala, yeah. All right. Africa. Uh, Africa. Human language probably began on this collection. No. On need net. No. <laughs> I'm not sure about it. Was. Break it down. Three three syllables. Africa, Australia, Amer uh, North America, South America, Europe, Asia, Antarctica. What are they? They're not countries there. Africa. On, on this. Uh, Continent. Continents. Continents. Yeah. Continents. The human are... language probably began on this continent, Africa, right? Because that's where humans began. Oh. There are... there are. There are 2,000 languages here. Many people in Africa can speak more than one language. Because as well as their own language, they also speak English, French, or Portuguese. French or Portuguese. French. All right. So uh, there are 2,000 languages, really. What happened to the other 146? Uh, <laughs> I you just decided you skip that. Ah, they're not important. We'll just say 2,000. 2,146 languages. Yes. 2,000. 146 languages. <laughs> All right. Australia and Oceania. 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 O Oceania. Is that right? Yep. Yep. Close enough. Uh, actually, Australia and Oceania. This area has two. This area has 1,300. 11 languages in total. The main language of Australia and New Zealand is language, but there are a lot of similar languages too. Papua New Guinea has only 4 million people, but it has 832 languages, more than any all the country and from and from new unfortunately unfortunately uh, netly, unfortunately netly, some uh boring boring aboriginal uh, first nation uh, people 
Aboriginal languages are really small now, but it has only one or two speaker. Okay, it's finished. Mm -hmm. Yes. Up straight. Sit up. Up, 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 up. Straight. Sit, sit, straight. What? Sit up straight. Sit up. What is me? Sit up straight. Like this. Yeah, so we can see you. See that big smile. Make your mommy happy. All right. So, yeah, small country, Papua, Papua New Guinea. And it is Guinea, but they pronounce it Papua New Guinea. Where is Papua New Guinea? You remember? Uh, I'm Papua, sure we talked about it. Papua. Papua. Where is Papua, Papua New Guinea? How's your geography? Papua New Guinea, yes. Where, where, where is that country? Uh, in Australia. And north of Australia, and it's next to Indonesia. That's right. All right. So, what are the three biggest languages in the world? Oh, I, Number uh, one. Chinese. Chinese. What do they speak in China? There's a word for it. It's not called Chinese. Everybody calls it Chinese, but that's not China. what it's called. What is it? China. No, the language. Uh, Chinese. No. Chinese. That's with an M. Chinese. Chinese. <laughs> uh, Mandarin. What? Mandarin? They call the number one national language in China. They call it Mandarin. Oh. Just like the little orange. Mandarin. Yeah. Mandarin. And there's another language that's the second language there is called Cantonese. Something wrong with you? Cantonese is the other one. What's the second largest spoken language in the world? Uh, the second. Uh-huh. Uh, English? No. It's English. No. English is not the second most spoken language. It is the international language, but not the second biggest. There's another uh, language that more people speak than English. Uh, Hindu. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh... Mm, Russia. Chai, chai, oi. Russia. No. no. Um, let me think. What do they speak um, in the Americas? What are the Romans. two biggest languages in the Americas? Romans. Romans. <laughs> oh. I ask you again, Donnie. What are the two most spoken languages in the Americas? English uh, and English and English and French. French is spoken in Canada. It's the second language in Canada. Well, it's the second most spoken language in Canada. It's, it's a it's a national language there. Oh, that is not the second most spoken language in the world. No. What do they speak in Mexico? What do they speak in Argentina? What do they speak in all the South American and Central American countries except England. Brazil? Brazil, they speak Portuguese. But all the other countries, what do they speak? What do Mexicans speak? Uh, Germanic. That's a family. Oh. Origin. Look in the Americas. Look in the Americas. It's right there in the first sentence. Second sentence. Oh. Spanish. Oh. Spanish is the second most spoken with like over 400 million speakers. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow. wow. What is the third? The third is... is E e Vietnamese English English. What is the fourth? The fourth is Hindi. Easy, easy. Where do they speak Hindi? What country? Uh, Myanmar, Cambodia. Uh, 
I'm going to give you a knuckle sandwich. <laughs> I don't know. India. I don't know where Hindi they speak. They speak Hindi in India. Oh. There's like 1.2 billion people there. Yeah, a lot of people speak Hindi. It's the fourth largest, which I'm surprised because, like I said, there's 1.2 billion people there and only or less than 300 million speak Hindi. That's really strange. Okay. What's number five? The five. E Arabic. Fifth is Arabic. Yeah, is, is, is. Which continent has the most languages? The most languages? Which continent? The most different languages. Uh, Australia and Oceania. Yeah. Australia and Oceania, they have 1,311 languages. Bah! Oh. Uh, most, the most, most, most. Uh, Asia. Asia, two thousand three hundred and three known languages. Whoa. What language family does Polish belong to? What's the origins of the Polish language? Where does it come from? Where is their great 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 great? Africa. Every language started in Africa, just like every person. If you go back 300,000 years ago, we have relatives. We're related. Everybody on the planet is related. Oh. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh. So, 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 so. No. What family? Remember in Europe, it talks about the Romance languages. You have Slavic languages. You have Germanic languages. What language does Polish belong to? Which family? Uh, family, um, Germanic. Oh my God, don't, don't, that's it. I'm going to talk to your mom. No. I'm going to talk to your mom. But I don't but know. You, you, but you, you just read it. Um. Look in the European, Europe, Europe paragraph there, the extract. Not an extract, but that little article. What does it say? The Romance languages include Spanish, Portuguese, and Italian. Yes. What else? What else? What else? What else? Is it Polish and Czech and Russian all belong to the same origins? What family does it belong to? Those languages. Because mm. they're different from Vietnamese. Different from English because their roots, their ancestry, right? Their their origins, where it started thousands of years ago, came from what language? What what call it a language, family of languages, where they all started, you know, just like a lot of religions, you know, Christians and a lot of different languages came from Catholic religions different things like that they, they 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 evolve over time oh my god donnie it's right there it's right there it's right there in the in the little paragraph look for polish czech and russian what languages do they come from what family uh, <laughs> i yes Yes, the answer is right in front of you. Language of the world here has um... Slavic. Another is Slavic languages, which are such as Russian, Polish, and Czech. English comes from the Germanic family. Uh, what is special about the Basque or Basque language? Why is it special? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, you do. It's right there in 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 in, in the Europe 
Arab. Yeah, under Europe. Look at that reading. Look in there. Find the answer. Let's go. You're taking too much time. You're going to fail this test if you don't start paying attention. Basque. What is unusual about Basque? Uh, Frank, Basque. 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 What is special about the Basque language? It's a language. Why is it different? Why is it special? Because it doesn't belong to language family. That's right. It doesn't belong to the Germanic history. It doesn't belong to the Slavic. It's a completely different. So nobody really knows where it comes from. It's very different. Different rules, everything else. What are the main languages in Canada? Uh, Frank and Nick. Frank. What kind of language is Frank? Uh, what kind of language is Frank? English and what? French. Fran. N N N -ch. French. French. Where do people speak mom or ma'am? M A M. Where do they speak that language? Uh, in part of Mexico and Guatemala. Guata. Guata. Guatemala. Guatemala. Yeah, it's pretty easy when you look at the letters, actually. All the sounds are made. Guata. Guatemala. Guatemala. Which country? Not continent. Which country has the largest number of languages? Mm. Which country? Largest uh, mm. number? Of languages, yes. yes. Country, not continent, right? Continent was Asia, 2,303 languages. Which uh, country? New Guinea. Yeah, Papua New Guinea. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That was a rough one, buddy. You didn't prepare at all, did you? No. Yes. No, you did not. Yeah. You read this before and you went through the questions? I don't believe you. Yes. <laughs> Ten point for Donny. Oh, you said a big claim, Donny, huh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. All right, buddy. That's it. We're done. We'll see you next week in interest 18. And we got to work on that pronunciation again. <sighs> that was rough. That was very rough. It was a tough read, but still, it was a little rough. We have to work on it. We have to get you to slow down and focus on the letters and the pronunciation, the sounds that are there. Okay. So, see you in Guatemala. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you in Guatemala. Guatemala. <laughs>